in my mind as soon as I talked to Dan and the Washington Center. I, I thought wings, freedom, that kind of stuff. When they presented the idea of the space and what they thought they wanted, I thought of unity and, and togetherness and multiple components coming together as one. And so that immediately sparked all these ideas of what shape can I make out of how many thousands of pieces. And, and so from there, just idea after idea, and then started thinking about like the deep end of it. You know, what does this piece mean? What can it mean? How do we spin that? How do we educate people on the piece? I didn't really have an idea of what the wing is gonna look like. I decided that I would let my subconscious kind of figure that out, right? So I just went in there and I was like, I probably want these to be whitish, clear, translucent somehow, um, maybe slightly iridescent. And so how do I achieve that? And then I just went in there and made one and it came out and that was it. Each wing is, you know, pretty small profile, but that's the point. It's by itself, it's this little wing, but together it's this mighty piece. Normally I spend a lot more time beating my head against the wall on certain things. And this was just one of those things that just naturally just came. I'm not one of those artists that makes art that is always inspirational. Like I make a lot of utilitarian art. I like purpose, um, functionality, and beauty all at once. You know, I feel like, and in the beginning, I think it was maybe because I needed to feed my family. And so I needed to make stuff that would sell and that just still stuck with me. But uh, so for me to like make a piece and have some sort of meaning behind it, it I went backwards on this piece. Like they wanted an installation um, and I immediately like thought of this installation and then it took me a, a long time actually to really think about what this piece could mean and what direction I wanted the meaning of this piece to be, right? That was more the question for me than the installation itself. I already knew exactly what I wanted it to look like. And then I like wanted to get some meaning behind it. So that's what ended up taking me almost long, way longer than the actual sculpture itself. It's my job as an artist to make sure that people stop and look at the beauty in life and, and realize there's things out there that, that are beautiful. And, Regardless of what happens in the world, you just keep moving forward.